Hey everybody, how's it going? Well, today, if you're a Harry Potter fan, it's a pretty damn good day. So apparently, a big AAA Harry Potter game is being released by Avalanche Studios. Some people thought it looked like a Rocksteady game, but it looks like Avalanche Studios is the corporate behind this. Now, in the gameplay footage, which I'm not going to show because they've been taking it down, you're throwing spells around. There's these trolls blocking a door, and the wizard that you play hits the door with an explosion spell that shatters the door, pins a troll against the wall with one of the splinters from the door, impaling it. It looked freaking phenomenal. Extremely next-gen. There was destructible environment. There was a lot of different aspects to the game. Not to mention spells that you can upgrade and a bunch of other cool things. That is RPG elements written all over it. And the person that released the footage also released a few texts. They said there was information about the game. It's set in the 19th century, so 1800 Wizarding World. It's third person open world action RPG game centers around your character and its unique abilities. And you have earned late acceptance to the Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. You are newly arrived, fifth year student, to Hogwarts that has a gift and an ability to track and identify remnants of ancient power. Strange events start to happen across the Forbidden Forest, and troubles begin to brew across the castle of Hogwarts. So together with Professor Elazar Fig, you embark on a journey through both familiar and never-before-seen locations. On your quest, you will craft potions, master spells, discover fantastical beasts, and also battle dark wizards, gobs, and other supernatural enemies to uncover the truth about your destiny and the fate of the wizarding world. Talk about a huge storyline. Everybody knows that Harry Potter is a phenomenon. I'm a huge Harry Potter fan. I've read all the books. I've seen all the movies. I think Harry Potter is one of the greatest franchises out there. And not to mention, one of the most unique, obviously. So, let's talk about some of the features that this game is going to have. You could journey through Hogwarts and become eight different wizarding types. Experience Hogwarts, make new friends, uncover new secrets, and change the fate of the wizarding world. Experience a new magic system that creates countless possibilities to master the magic that you want. It kind of seems like they're going to put the combat together and maybe you can mix and match spells to cause havoc and rain terror on your enemies. Freely explore the wizarding world for the first time. Choose your house that you want to be, Gryffindor, Hufflepuff, Ravenclaw, Slytherin. And also you'll be able to choose your friends and decide to pursue a path of good and evil. Create your own witch and wizard and experience all the story separate from the books or films. So the game is going to be separate from the Harry Potter world and the franchise that we know and the characters that we know. I'm pretty sure there's going to be hints of them because it's such a popular and world-renowned franchise. But I have to say that you can go evil or good in the game really makes it intriguing. Can you end up being the next Voldemort? Can you make your own legacy of being a dark wizard? Or can you be someone like Harry Potter or Dumbledore? I think these are pretty badass features for the game. I want to see it played more. The gameplay footage, you can look it up. It's about a, a minute and 20 seconds long. You can find it somewhere, but I don't feel comfortable putting it on my channel. But you should go really check it out. It truly looks next gen, and it looks like a lot of fun. To me, it looks a little bit like a Rocksteady game, but I don't think it's them. I think it's Avalanche Studios. So everybody, check out the footage. Go look it up. It looks absolutely stunning, everybody. I really recommend you go check it out. Well, everybody, like always, enjoy your gaming, and I'll talk to you later. Have a good one.